Hello and welcome to PeopleSoft channel. If you are working in PeopleSoft Finance, one reporting tool is hard to ignore. If you are here, you already know the answer. It's none other than Envision. By the way, PeopleSoft has no plans of replacing it in the near future, just like they replaced Crystal Reports with BI Publisher. At least that's what I heard from the Oracle support team. Being a finance guy and Oracle have no plans of replacing it, so I started working on it. Trust me guys, it's not easy to understand. Today I am here to break it down and help you create and troubleshoot Envision reports. My name is Siva Koya and I am a PeopleSoft finance developer all my career. In this first episode of Envision tutorial, I will introduce you to Envision about what kind of work it does. Then we will locate the Envision installation file and run Envision client. I have taken a slightly different approach for this tutorial. I will try to paint the real life situation to explain the concepts behind Envision. All right, let's begin. Once upon a time, there was a successful businessman called Mike. He was the CEO of publicly traded company called Adventure. Basically, it's an online travel agency like Kayak, Expedia. He grew his company from one employee to 10,000 employees in a short span of five years. Since the company has grown big, naturally, he wants to improve managing his financial resources more efficiently, like paying suppliers on time or automating the purchase order process or keep track of how much money is coming into the company and how much money is going out of the company in the form of expenses. He had a lot of money, so he spent a million dollars and bought people's off license. Let's do a time travel and go back to those days and see what's going on when they are implementing PeopleSoft. First and foremost, as a publicly traded company, his company needs to submit financial statements to US Securities and Exchange Commission on an ongoing basis, once in every quarter and once in every year. The core financial statements include income statement, balance sheet, and cash flow statement. For instance, income statement tells you if company is making money, just like Apple is doing it for many years, or losing money, like Tesla, again, for many years. General investors like you and me can understand by looking at the consolidated numbers on the income statement to make a buy or sell decision in case if you are considering buying a stock. Which reporting tool in PeopleSoft does this crucial financial reporting for us? Blow the trumpet along with me. It's the Envision. If our CEO Mike wants to know how much revenue is generated from the past five years, again, Envision can do it. Those are few capabilities of Envision. Let's move ahead in our story. Let me introduce you to the senior account manager of our company adventure, Jill. Jill and his team are Excel experts who know how to play with Excel formulas and format the data and even they can add custom columns with additional calculations. Usually all accountants are good at this task. The point is Jill and his team will appreciate if people's of development team can generate the financial reports they requested in the Excel format. The first assignment, Jill wants a financial report that shows how much money the company got in the form of current assets. The report should be in the Excel format and he assigned this task to PeopleSoft development team. It's time to introduce our hero, the hero of this Envision tutorial, Rocky. Rocky is a senior PeopleSoft developer who works for our company Adventure, but he never worked on Envision. He has taken up this crucial task to get the job done for Jill. Rocky, after doing a little bit of digging in people books, came to conclusion only one tool in PeopleSoft can make the job easy for him. That is Envision. He also found in people books Envision with its magic engine behind the scenes pulls the core financial data requested by Jill and it loads into Excel. Rocky is all set to fire up Envision now. This is what he did. He navigated to People Tools Home, Bin, Client, Win86, and looked for the file PSNVS. Just double click it. Now we have opened the Envision Thick Client. Mm -hmm. 
There is also a second way to fire up Envision. Open your app designer, select go from the menu and select Envision from the drop down. Rocky calls this as Envision designer. This is the only place where he can create and open existing Envision reports. We will explore each and every option of this designer in the upcoming episode. That's it for today guys. In the next episode, we will follow Rocky and understand the foundation concepts of Envision and how it pulls the key financial information into Excel.